Hello there. In this video, we will be looking into the 18 tips you can utilize to create better webinars. We will be learning about all the different thought processes that go into understanding how to make the best out of virtual events. This is part 1 of the series to create the best webinars for your business, in this video we will be covering the first 9 tips. Let us look into the 18 tips required in creating the best webinars possible. 1. Creating a webinar series, explaining a topic in depth to get repeat engagement. To get the most of our repeat engagement, you would need to create a webinar series which is capable of explaining a topic in depth. This gives you the opportunity in covering a topic by giving prospects a better reason in coming back and engaging with them. You can register multiple webinars with series which results in more than 10x registrations and also has 5.5x more sign-ups than your average webinars. 2. Webinars should be designed in a conversational manner. Creating a webinar may seem difficult and you need to create webinars to create a structure for your webinars to be more like organic conversations. This will also prove to be very engaging and interesting for people to watch. Having a loose structure with slides which contain thought-provoking questions will help to engage experts. Debate-style webinars are incredible for engagement as they are much easier to put on and are more enjoyable to watch. 3. Making your customers' stories, the center of attraction. Here's another way to put on a webinar with a lighter lift that's actually more persuasive, let your customers do the talking. Their authentic stories will be far more convincing and well-rounded than your typical canned marketing pitch. Since the customer has first-hand experience using your products or services, their stories can provide helpful peer-to-peer -peer insights that are impossible to replicate from inside your company. You need to make sure your customer's story reflects the positive aspects of the brand. 4. Always experiment and analyze the results. You always need to experiment and analyze the results from your online experiments. You never know where your next best idea is going to come from. The best way to combat this is to work and test out creative ideas, constantly iterate and optimize by testing out various ideas. One of the best ways to produce quality webinars is to start somewhere and you can focus on optimizing to support your decisions much later. 5. Promoting your webinar registrations with the help of your sales team. The sales team can be a major ally in promoting webinars if you equip them properly. You can email them in advance with the details of the webinar, as well as some bullet points on the value that it'll drive for prospects, so they can recommend it to the right people at the right time in their sales cycles. 6. Make the most of registration confirmation emails with curated content recommendations. We all know how hard it is to grab a precious moment of your prospect's attention. So once you've got it, it's a good practice to use that moment to the fullest. Instead of your run-of-the-mill confirmation email, try sending some curated content recommendations related to the topic of your webinar in that email. 7. Mixing up HTML, plain text and video promotional types of email. It is important to mix up your promotional types of email by mixing up HTML, plain text and video promotions. This will help you to capture your audience attention in a consistent manner by keeping it fresh. It is important to keep your prospects always guessing by keeping them on their toes and mixing up the promotional content. It is important to alternate between plain text, video promotion and HTML emails to make your text emails feel more simple and casual. 8. Be ready to promote your webinars 5 to 6 weeks in advance. You have to be ready to promote all of your webinars, at least 5 to 6 weeks in advance. This is because people are usually busy, due to channels being oversaturated. However, the earlier you are in promoting your webinars, the more it will make easier for people to create the time in their calendars for your webinars. This will help you run promotions, capture your audience's attention and also build a sizable following. 9. Switch up your promotional channels by varying up the content. It is important to always switch up your promotional content by varying up the content as a key factor in being successful to get you registrations. By using paid social media you can promote your webinar to get form fills and also building your database. The webinar leads you to produce a great and meaningful pipeline with the help of an influenced revenue. In conclusion, these are 9 tips in creating the best webinars for your business. This was the first part of the process of creating the best webinars for your business. If you want to create webinars, you should work with OnPassive to help you create the best webinars. We hope you found this video informative in understanding how to improve your webinars. 
Stay tuned for our next series in creating better webinars. Thanks for listening.